I love flying. I think it is the best thing ever. And I think that a lot of our students don't get that opportunity to experience it, um, mainly because of the cost. It's very, very expensive. This just gives them more, um, more choices in their life. Super excited to tell you about the Oregon Aerospace Careers for Everyone program. Um, we use underline on everyone uh, to mean that we are including all the diversity of our student body in this program. As an airline pilot, I recognize that our community looks very similar to myself. Um, we do not do a very good job of finding uh, females in that community, of, of people of Latinx descent, of African Americans. We need to diversify. Um, and there's a huge shortfall. Boeing's 20-year forecast is that globally, in 20 years, we're going to need 2.4 million more pilots and technicians. So um, this program is all about connecting students to those jobs, whether you're, you want to be a pilot, um, a mechanic, technician, or part of a crew, or just work around aerospace, which could be anything from manufacturing to uh, retail. What I think has been phenomenal is, is the drive that HSD has had working with PCC and the Port of Portland. The air show or the foundation has been able to kind of bring us all together after almost 1,800 to 2,000 uh, hours, volunteer hours that have happened from a bunch of other uh, local businesses have all come together as a team in order to completely remodel this space. This is the old uh, radio station. And I think what's amazing about this space is one, how it's transformed. Two, it really embodies, I believe, our community. Aviation for me is, since I was a child, is something I've loved. Um, and I've realized how it's just been such an amazing ability to excite people and make uh, kids specifically excited about learning. What really excites me is being able to show them the door that they have the option to walk through about all the different careers that are available to them that they might not have known about before. So one of our answers to that is to start working with students and families early. In this case, in middle school, we've provided programming to get kids aware of the OACE program. Then they can register when they forecast for their freshman year into the classes that are gonna happen here with Sherry Fisher, our new teacher. The program is four years. So really there's two tracks in the program. There is the pilot track and there's the mechanic track. The opportunities, there's so much more in between there, but those are the two tracks that will feed into um, PCC. And then at the end of four years, um, they will have received the equivalent of 16 credits at PCC. If we're looking at a shortage of 200,000 pilots, our question is, if we can't open the doorway to more diverse human beings to that industry, how could we possibly fill um, that workforce demand? Uh, we want students to know that they can be leaders and that they're ready to do that type of work now. Being a first generation woman interested in science is out of this world. It was so cool. I thought it was going to be like uh, like just like a whole building like with no windows, but it turns out we have like the action out there and I was just like, wait, so interesting and then I, it's just a wow. 